Now, when it comes to talking about the war, trauma responses from violent events and graphic images can be hard to understand and even harder to talk about. Haley Kirby spoke with a mental health expert for some tips on how to choose the right words when talking to kids. Sylvia Groves is the mental health director at EVSC. She says it's okay if you don't fully understand the conflict in Israel and to be open about that. Parents should know it's okay to say, I'm not really sure. You know, it's hard for me to understand this too. It's important to talk to your child in an age appropriate manner. Let the children's questions guide your discussion. They may have heard about the conflict and may be concerned about it. They may not have. So don't assume that they have the same kind of concerns adults do. And if they're older or more curious. Well, let's do that together. Let's go to some trusted websites, some trusted sources, and see if we can find out the background about why this is happening. Another important reminder is to reaffirm safety here. Reaffirm to them that these events are happening far away from where we live. We, of course, can't guarantee, you know, perfect safety all the time, but just always bring it back to what are the things that we know happen in our home, in our school, in our community that do keep us safe. And make sure to be watching out for more severe warning signs of a trauma response. Really watch for any changes in their behavior from what you typically expect and know when it might be time to seek some outside resources. Make sure the school knows and then they can be watching for things that are going on at school as well. If you are concerned that your child has been exposed, you can say something like, you know, share with me what it is that you've seen or what you heard and um, talk to them about um, you know, how does, how does that make you feel and what are some things that we can do to, um, to address that. And most importantly, make time to have these conversations. Well, that was Haley Kirby reporting, and there are a lot of claims online surrounding the war, and it's important to decipher what's real from what is fake. So our team is helping you do that. We have a section on our site dedicated to this war. You can scan this QR code on your screen to get to that page and just or just scroll to the featured section on our website.